Hi guys, today I want to talk to you about kinetic energy. So what is kinetic energy? When an object is in motion, it has kinetic energy. We can calculate the amount of kinetic energy by using this formula, half times m times v squared. m is the mass in kilograms, and v is velocity in meters per second. And just note the v squared, well it's v times v, it's not the whole formula that's squared. A bullet example. A 30 gram bullet travels at 300 meters per second. How much kinetic energy does it have? Well, firstly, we need to convert from grams to kilograms. So we need to divide by a thousand. So we've got 30 grams, which is 0 0.03 kilograms. Our velocity is 300 meters per second. So let's put it in our formula, half mv squared. So we've got a half times 0 0.03 times 300 times 300 and we get 1,350 joules. Man versus meteor. A 70 kilogram man runs at a pace of four meters per second and a 50 gram meteor travels at two kilometers per second, which is the most kinetic energy. So we've got half mv squared. So for the man, it's a half times 70 times four squared, which is 560 joules. However, for the meteor, first, don't forget we need to convert our mass into kilograms, so it's 0 0.05 kilograms. And the 2 kilometers per second, well, that's 2,000 meters per second. So let's put that in our formula, half mv squared, so we've got a half times 0 0.05 times 2,000 squared, and we get a huge uh, 100,000 joules. So the meteorite, or the meteor, definitely has much more kinetic energy. What is the speed of the truck? So a 5,000 kilogram truck has 400,000 joules of kinetic energy. How fast is it moving? So we're gonna use half mv squared is equal to uh, 400,000 joules. Uh, we know the mass, so we can put that in our formula. So a half times 5,000 times v squared is equal to 400,000. Now let's move the half and the 5,000 over to the other side, so we're dividing. So we get v squared equals uh, 400,000 divided by a half times 5,000, which is one thousand. Sorry, which is 160. Uh, if we square root that answer, we're gonna find our velocity, which is 12.6 meters per second. What is the mass of the car? A car traveling at 10 meters per second has 200,000 joules of kinetic energy. What is the mass of the car? Well, we're going to use our formula, half mv squared, and that's equal to 200,000 joules. So a half times m times, well, the velocity is 10 meters per second, so times 10, me, times 10 squared, and that's equal to 200,000. So we've got a half times m times 100 is equal to 200,000. Okay, let's just uh, rearrange, make m the subject. So we get 200,000 divided by a half times 100, which gives us 4,000 kilograms. Okay, guys, I hope that's been useful. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Goodbye for now.